it up too. Now I'm rocking with Master Instinct. Got cuz with me today. We down here. Ah, uh, here's another one of the locations and areas I be telling y'all. This land back here got about six pines on it. So, fence is up, so we gotta do some walking, but <laughs> rocking with salt and pepper fishing. Last day of state. Uh, we gonna try and sip the old big bass. This pine be loaded. Well, hit that lower right subscribe button. And let's see what we get. out here still a nice little hike we're gonna go to the hidden pond it's off in the woods so uh, i've been fishing this land this is in creedmoor north carolina i met this older guy the owner of this land i met him back about this been years ago just doing a good deed he helped him out him and his wife was trying to help him with the tire and I was actually going on my way to go fishing that day and he brought me back here on his land and I got that access to six pines so I try to fish him as much as I can when I get the chance when I'm in the area but a lot of this just want to take you on a little Oh, a master instinct, so I love wild, wildlife. So, we do this often. You know, that keep us old guys intact, you know what I'm saying? You see him, you see him, he ready for war. He, he, he shoot. But, all right, rockin' with ain't. Uh, let me see, I think ain't this is it or the second one? It's the next one. But yeah. Salt and pepper fishing. Appreciate all of y'all checking us out, hitting us. Hit that lower right subscribe button. Uh, hopefully some of the tips and the fishing you see I'm doing help you out on a successful day of catching meat. So, but just remember any day is a good day. This is it right here. Yeah, well, so. Well, I'm at it. Y'all just stay with me. We're going to take a little hike. And in your states. Remember I told you about that. The purple law. If you see the purple, know these people and have permission like we have to come on this property and fish. Other than that, that means trespassing. So... Old Master Instinct taking in some uncharted territory, so good places to. I think the last time has been a long time ago, but Big Cuz that's with me right there. Yeah, we've been fishing it over 30 something with him that long. I've been fishing it 18. But. Yeah, this thing one time my cousin hooked into an eight pound bass, lost him. He got hung in front of us and some of these, this pond is deep. So you gotta be careful. Yeah, I know, but I'm trying to go through a little clear path. Uh, when you're in these woods and shit like that, back territories and you wanna make sure you watching for spiders and snakes and ticks and all of that because they can get on you. It's pretty clear down in these, but if you can see, that's why I'm using the pole to sweep through because you got webs and mess around and walk into a nest, a spider's nest. But all right, we coming up to the pond here. 
Ah, uh, we bring an old bucket with us because in here, you put your fish on a fish rope, you might be in a fight with some dang on turtles over eating up your fish. So, that's a little tip. All right, we're to the destination. So, like I said, it's a it's kind of it's fed off of frogs. When the frog tadpoles lay their eggs, they're everywhere in here by the millions. This is one end, but this pond goes all the way back down that way. So let me get in here and see what me and Cuzzo gonna get. Hooked into somebody. Oh, look at that. What? He broke? He broke it? What? Not mine. Oh man, he got me re Did you see that action, y'all? Okay. So. Yeah, you yeah, just don't. Uh, yeah, right. just. Uh, okay. Um, but, man, I'll get home um, probably about 5 30 or so. Mm -hmm. um, I'll, I'll, I'll text her, give you a call around, and we'll cut up the time. Does that, that sound okay? All right, that'll work, buddy. All right, cool, Bob. We'll talk to you later this afternoon. All right, my hope, brother. Good luck, good luck fishing, man. Hope you, hope you catch some big ones. All right, got one on the line now. Awesome. Okay, uh, All right, later. All right, two. The black. Yeah. We got a corporate already, so. Got a convict. Got a convict. All right. With Master Eight. Uh, that was one of my good fishing buddies there checking into some things for me on the trip out to Lake Havasu. Alright, y'all. First corporate. Going around this pond here. Uh, this thing is loaded. We pull some record bass out of this pond here. This thing got huge two, three pound bluegill in it. So, stay tuned. That's cause trying to... But this is what fishing is about. Sometimes you gotta hike to your location or your destination. Either way it go. Yeah, sometimes it's good. We're getting old now, so we bring our old bucket. Because you can fill it up quick. I recommend no fish string in here. Because you're going to have hell walking out with it. But, <laughs> all right, too. That's another little back area. We come and hit. So, oh, red, look, baby Bambi. I told y'all I always see, show you some wildlife. All right, I'll be back with a bag. Fish sticks. All right, cuz just lost one. Hung him up on the fish sticks. Cuz I hooked it to a nice one over there. But, uh, actually, they got us working a little bit. Usually in here, when they in here really turned on, you have a good bass action day. All right. See what we're working with. Oh, another nice one. About a pound and a half. You see him, he, he over there headed to the bucket with him. He like, shoot, let me get him in there. <laughs> All right. Uh, Man, hey, that's what Tricky Nicky produce all day. That all black, day. all day. All right. Oh, he out here trying to get old cuz today. Put him on in there. What you mean? All right, some more action. And I got another one. I look like cuz trying to put in some work on 
Oh no, Master Instinct today, you too. Yeah, I'm gonna always strike back. Uh, a lot of people, I don't know how they love the bass fish, but we specialize in these trick worms, so. But I know some people. Patience is the key when you're bassing. I know some people love to move all around and stuff, and okay. even though they move. What? Well, all right, let's see what this dude working with. Oh, man, I forgot you ain't got one of mine. Uh, we ain't got no... Any stick? I don't even know if the stick gonna work, boy. He down in here. All right. Oh, he, he hit it and running right here in my face. Alright. Go you another bass. Uh, like I say, the trick worms. We've been playing with these worms for years. It's just how you learn to play with the worm. To, you can catch bass on any given day. Tricky. She's sure doing her job. Oh, he gonna try to run me down up under that tree, huh? Oh, nah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about, too. That's what I'm talking about, too. Tricky Nicky. Black Dingling. Try to tell y'all, like the pack say, bass love them. If y'all ain't figured that out by now, <laughs> but you're working with Master Instinct, salt and pepper fishing, going to get you another one. We got the worm, he's steady coming out. I think that's a brim, but we hung on the limb, but go back he kept coming up out of the water for it so how much they love him they see that mug dinging out of the tree let's see if we can go and make him make him get it let y'all see me work live in action see if we can trick him again uh, did he pick it up already he sure did oh he better go that might be old big brim i think that's one of the beds like I told you, it's some monster bluegill in this pond. We can come in here with a tube of cricket and walk out of here with 50, 60 hand size. I ain't talking about pan size. I said hand size. Believe it. But we on the hunt for the old bass today. So we giving them a break. Uh, but stay tuned. Here, boy. I don't know where he running himself off to, but... Mm. All right, y'all. Like I said, the bass, love them. Get them zoom, black trick worm. If you haven't, you see what they do. Like I say, yeah, right across to the right. Like I say, trick or treat. Don't step on the pole, cause or, or your ass won't eat. <laughs> cause that trick worm gonna make sure you eat. Rockin' master instinct, some pepper fishing. Got cousin G rocking with us today. All right. So far successful. Me and cuz ain't doing too bad, but we had a time frame. Uh, check us out. Salt and pepper fishing. <laughs> Excuse me. You rocking with Master Instinct? Uh, today, 
Like I said, hidden pond in the woods. Been here fishing it 18 years. So, just had to stay tuned. I always got ponds for y'all, I told you. Somewhere everywhere. All over the NC, but you rocking with Master Instinct, salt and pepper fishing. You got Cuz over there. He's still working with us today, so. Uh, appreciate my subscribers and some viewers and my viewers. Trick your treat. Like they say, your ass don't eat. But All right, we had a successful day. Me and Cuz got Cuz rocking with us. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? One. We coming out, beat him by two. Oh. We coming up out these old woods. We gonna go this way, but rocking with instinct. Not a bad day. Like I said, any day fishing is a good day. By the words of Big Brother Rambo. So, just stay tuned. Uh, like I say, we never leave empty handed. I think we got about six, seven nice bass. So you can't ask for nothing better. Don't cut no better than that, but hit that little like right subscribe button. Thank you for checking out the sound of pepper. We're gonna get up out of these woods before it gets too dark. Next time, trick or treat. Oh, yeah, it's gonna be.